Whoa. What's going on, guys? Can you see me? All these glasses are a little weird on the camera, huh? Sorry about that. Anyway, happy Saturday. Man, I had to really think about what, uh, what day it was first before I said that because I know my days of the week by what am I training that day, you know, and it's kind of like a backwards process, right? So I'll look, I'll be like, all right, today's chest day. So I know today's chest day or back day or shoulders or whatever it is. And then I backlog, I'm like, I train chest on Tuesday, so it's Tuesday. You know, but right now, since I'm not, not able to train, man, it's wild. I mean, like, time purgatory, you know? Like that time in between Christmas and New Year's where nobody knows what day it is or what's going on. That's, that's like the limbo I'm in right now. But I was in a rush this morning, so I couldn't really figure out or take a look at my shoulders, see what was going on, because I kept the, uh, what do you call it? A lot of loss of words today, guys. <clears throat> the gauze, the gauze over it. So I didn't get a chance to look at it this morning. It doesn't hurt any more than normal, so I think it's all right. I'm hoping the actual body of this big infection is like slowly dwindling, a little, dwindling away a little bit. But besides that, man, we're uh, gonna check that out when we get home. I beat up my clients this morning. That was a good time. Just smashed an egg sandwich. And we were on our way to, God, we might get a bagel too. It's, you know, it's one of those, as you can see out the window, it's a very snowy day here on Long Island. And it's the nice kind of snow, you know? But it hasn't turned into a mess yet, and it's a lot of it. So it just looks nice and fluffy and pretty, and everything's good in the world. And my dog's gonna want to go out of, out of the house 30 times today because he loves playing in the snow. And I'm gonna let him because I like seeing him happy, you know? But that's where we're at right now, man. So <clears throat> I'm hoping, fingers crossed, to be back in the gym at some point next week. I don't care if it's some random full body workout, just to something. So I'm going a little I'm going a little kooky over here now, you know? I have four full days left, <clears throat> including today, of this stronger antibiotic. And I'm optimistic that it'll it'll clear things up, you know? I'm not sure about the side effects of this one yet. I know I'm not really a big headache kind of guy. You know, I keep those people kind of away out of my life. But I noticed yesterday I had a pretty, not throbbing, but consistent headache all day. So, I don't know if it's because I was gaming too much that day, which I haven't done in God knows how long. I was just staring at the screen all day, which sure it didn't help but I really didn't have anything else to do but I don't know man so we stopped at Stop and Shop got our food for a couple days or so give or take and being out and about still hurts the shoulder quite a bit you know it's when your lats are as wide as mine are what happens is your arms rest on your lats, right? No, excuse me. Because my arms are resting further away from my body, my shoulders are activated all day, holding up my arms because they're away from the body, right? Instead of being pinned close where they're resting, they're out here a little bit, they're being worked. So I have constant just flexing, if you will, of my lateral head and my shoulders just living my normal life. And normally it's fine, you know, I don't even, I don't even notice it because I'm just living. But now that there's an, an open wound in there, I'm like, ah, all day, just like, that hurts. You know, it's like, imagine if you cut your arm. It's like picking something up when you cut your finger, you know? It's like, ah, stop that, you know? But 
I'm grateful that everything seems freaking knock on wood to be going in the right direction, you know? Besides that, man, <clears throat> there's not too much to talk about living in this purgatory moment. So everybody that's still here, you know, I appreciate you guys sticking along for the journey. You know that we're going to get right back to our regular scheduled content. But I did want to make sure to continue to put things out for you guys seven days a week because that's what we do, that's what we agreed upon. And it's who we are, that's what we're about, man, you know? One thing I'm not going to like is that first posing session after this two-week hiatus. Because I'm eating as much food as I can to make sure I keep my weight over 230. And I think we're good. I think we found a good maintenance calories for it, so it'll be all right. But I'm not looking forward to that, man. You know? sick like this, your supplements are completely off, <clears throat> because it can hinder with antibiotics. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> so supplements are all off, diet's out of whack, I'm not training, I'm like a walking, I'm not quite a civilian yet, but we're walking into, uh, into that dangerous territory, you know? So, I'm not going to take up too much of your time today, because it's nothing... Nothing fancy going on right now, nothing fun to talk about, nothing exciting to train with. You know, I'm just, like I said, in that time purgatory now. So, once again, I appreciate you guys sticking by. We'll be out of this soon enough, and freaking knock on wood, it'll be the last time this happens. Because I don't see why it should happen again. Take care of yourselves, have a great day. Go sledding. Go sledding. <laughs>